Hey guys, what's going on? It's Roger Death here. Welcome to what I believe to be episode 13 of my Crusader Kings playthrough. Again, I'll have to figure it out completely uh, later. So, um, we have to figure out where we're gonna, where our next move is going to be. It's not going to be Aquatane. I can tell you that. Let me see if I can kill the leader of Mercea. Nope, it's basically just me in that plot. Uh, which is lame. So, right now, we, we are very much doing a hurry up and wait idea. Because we need to upgrade a bunch of stuff. Oh, no. Traders. Oh, that's right. I need to deal with this. Uh, actually, that's in the right section. I have these all sorted out. My mainly heavy infantry section here. My left flank, this one. Uh, does is the one that's got all the archers and some defense for them, and then my cavalry unit is on the other side. It's a very successful thing, judging by how it's gone. Uh, I got the Barony of Richmond. Awesome. Go to my court. Why? Why are you pissed at me? Because I'm arbitrary, because I'm dumb. I'm cruel, I'm craven, I have a short reign. The short reign is, is going away. Oh, and as soon as this war is over, I need to deal with uh, changing my crown laws. Actually, I can do it now. Uh, what was I going to do? Uh, oh, I was going to give one of my guys some land. Here, here's the Barony of Richmond. Want to watch these men get slaughtered? He truly deserves it. Most valiant performance. And fought hard he did. Their opinion of me grows up more than everybody else's will. Uh, everybody else's opinion of me does... Oh no, my opinion of everybody else apparently goes up. Which is nice. This is where uh, manipulation of the AI kinda sucks. Cause I'm gonna be ch oh, never mind. Uh, I'm going to be slaughtering peasants. Uh, I was on the uh, Crusader Kings 2 subreddit earlier today. And that's how I... Oh, twins. Ah, sucky. I mean, it's not the worst thing that could have happened, but... Uh, offer peace, enforce demands. Awesome. Victory is mine. Did you hurry up and, like, die or something? What are you guys in a war for? An Argonian peasant... What? The peasant revolt that you guys need to take care of. Huh. So when I started my invasion, Brittany still existed. And I used it. But that's not there anymore. Um, I mean, I guess I could... Uh, start down here in Spain. Yeah, I mean, it wouldn't be the worst idea I've ever heard of. I mean, it's not the best one either, to be fair, but... Uh, it would allow me to start somewhere. So, first things first. Who's a... Uh... Here you are, all here. I'm going to do something very risky and give you the Kingdom of Ireland. I actually should destroy this first, but I don't think I can. I'm trying to change all my laws to medium crown or medium approval. And it'll happen, it just needs to take some time. Wonderful, I got more technology points. Uh, put that into church infrastructure. So they can prepare churches and, and such, or the temples and such, more so. This will mainly take effect in Sudrayar here, so this is going to be the best place to build improvements and stuff. Uh, so I need to... Increase my... If I want to increase my twin size, I have to build a training grounds, but that's expensive. 
It also takes a long time to build. But it also increases uh, my levy re reinforcement rate and improves the morale of my men. Uh, otherwise, I can just... I wish I could see which of my guys gives the most troops quickly. I can't hear, but... I mean... I can't do anything about these guys. Oh, wait, I can. It's, uh... To raise my vassal levies. Who has raised the most? You have over here an ossery. Why? Is it because you have the Jarl and you're pulling him from other areas? Hmm. I don't know. This is odd. Normally, my vet, I, there's a lot more pulled, but. I don't know, so let's raise my personal levies and see where I'm getting a lot of guys from. I'm getting more guys from up here than anywhere else. Uh, because I've upgraded my keep. Uh, I need to edit. I can't do anything else, really. This is, this is both good and not good at the same time. Okay, whatever. Uh, we will lower that. I don't know how I'm above what I should be. Uh, that doesn't make a lot of sense. But, uh, whatever. I'm not gonna complain because it gave me extra shit. So, I kinda. W so, I want to destroy this title here. But I don't think I can do that. if we could kill this guy. But we can't. Oh shit, heresy. Um, that's the downside, is that uh, Catholicism has a bunch of heresies. Uh, according to the church. And we'll, we'll leave the daughter's uh, names as is. I don't really give a shit about their names. That much. Uh, I have too many duchies currently. That uh, people should be pissed at me for this. I can't believe that's the only thing in the Duchy of Wessex. That that doesn't seem right. De jure, it's not. So I'll give it to him, and that should modify. What all it is? Yeah. Uh, apparently he's in charge of Lincoln for whatever reason. I don't... Jesus Christ, I don't know. Shit, 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 shit just gets fucked up, man. That, uh, that raised opinions of me. Cool. So that helped. Uh, I'm gonna take the plunge. I'm probably gonna regret this. Here, have the, uh... Kingdom of Ireland. I I should do this to Jarl so I don't get comp so my guys aren't completely pissed at me. I'd like it if I had a Catholic Jarl up here, but it doesn't appear that I do. Uh, he is actually. I lied. Congratulations. You now have the Kingdom of Scotland. I hope this doesn't backfire on me terribly. But I don't honestly know if it will. Why are you pissed at me? I have too many held duchies. And you want the Duchy of Kent? Well, congratulations. You have the Duchy of Kent. Uh, I can't give myself titles. You, I don't. I don't want to give the same person. 
I'm fairly certain this falls under the Duchy of the Huberth. So we're going to give it to him. What this does is it basically makes it a lot easier for me to not worry about the other things. I think what I'm going to start doing from now on is I'm going to wait to form something until I have everything in it that'll help with this weird bullshit border situation. Uh, that the exception is for my primary title, which is always going to be right, because it's me. It's what I want. And uh, where does the where's the Duchy of Sudre are? I actually own both these. Really? That can't be all. It's in the Duchy of Sudre are. De jure County of Man is. Uh, Okay. Congratulations. You are now the du you are now the high chiefess of Sudrear. Why are you pissed at me? Cuz you want the county of Sudrear and whatever. There's got to be better ways to go about this. I'll figure it out eventually. I'm I'm absolutely terrible, terrible as shit at matching my empire. If you haven't noticed. Right then, so let's put some improvements down. Actually, I take that back. Let's not put any improvements down. We'll wait for a bit. Uh, do I even want Denmark? I mean, it's, it's another kingdom, but he's defending against heathens, so no, I'm going to say no, I don't want it. Santiago will be our first place of invasion. Because it's a small little area down here. So hopefully that'll work out. I actually can't change the laws in any of the other kingdoms now. It's kind of lame. Uh, so, how are people's opinions of me? Why is it so high? Because I have a female heir or because of all my shitty traits? Yeah, I know. I got terrible traits. It's too distant of a relative. Uh, so I guess we're base it's gonna be a sit and wait for Uh oh. If I change him my current steward has a sixteen and you have an eighteen, but you're getting ready to die. Give him a chance. Hopefully you'll die before you can uh, enforce that. <laughs> uh, that would be nice. Uh, Brunswick over here wouldn't be too bad of an area to start invading in either. I just kind of want to stay away from... Right now, at this time period, there's two places I want to stay away from. Actually, I guess there's a few. There's West Francia here, who has apparently taken over... Uh, what's its name? Aquitaine. Uh, I want to stay away from West Francia. I want to stay away from Hungary. And I want to stay away from Cumania. I did not have a good time. A Sultanite and a... Oh god, Molly are so annoying. I play... I hate them in EU 4. Alright, let's, let's just hurry up and wait. Things going really fast? I hope so. I'm waiting for my truce to exp my truce to expire. Oh, with not the quiet sale of Mercia. Eight years. And I don't 
have the diplomacy to get anybody else on my side, so we're just gonna... We're basically gonna have to wait until we get a, uh, Casa's Belly. Or Casa's Belly, I don't know. I don't, I don't know how to pronounce that shit, man. Uh, I have a question. What does my levy look like? Uh, oh, wow, I can get a lot of ships. That's actually really important. Oh. Give him a chance. My chancellor died. Uh, so now I have to send him back down here. Is this, uh, he's currently, uh, trying to revolt from Asturias. I don't know if I could take Asturias, but I'd like to not try. Fabricate claims on Glicia. Can I actually just declare war on you? Uh, apparently I can't declare holy war yet. It's kind of lame. That was a big secret to my expansion is the holy war. Oh no. Civil War! Thankfully, oh god, no, the fort. I've got to do all. Oh, Jesus. This is a terrible civil war. <sighs> Shit. This is some. This is the uh, common issue with doing what I've been doing of the hurry up and wait strategy. That said, you. I have a good chance of assassinating. Oh, good. I got my medium crown thing now, so so that's nice. Um, in the meantime, I just lost like most of my military strength. So you'll have to. Oh, gods. Um, you'll just have to give me a little bit to get that back. A4, I will formally wage war on you. <laughs> uh, oh, I'll approve medium crown authority. I want. I love how he can get it to pass, but I couldn't earlier. I have deduced that this game hates me. Uh oh. Uh, that means more troops appear. Holy Jesus Christ! That might actually be a fight for the death stack. <laughs> Lost very few men. Because of the outrageous power of Death Stack. It's actually really silly how strong the uh, Death Stack can be. I love how these guys look like they stayed uh, true to me. Yeah, Ireland's just being a dick. Oh, that force I wanted to avoid is, is killing my guys down there. That's not good. If this guy gets assassinated, and there, this is the main reason I'm trying to get him assassinated, is uh, his thing ends. His entire ploy ends. Everything he was working for is just over. Yeah, he knew he was dead, so he's like, oh, screw it, I'm dead. Run! No, don't die. Ah, shit, quit doing this. Alright.
kill your troops. This deck is so ridiculously strong. I I'm not losing very many guys, and I just uh, kill everything. It's kind of hilarious. <laughs> I took care of all of them. And when I say all, I mean all. Until they rise up, until more guys rise up, like they are right here, uh, that I just walk over. Let her handle it, she gains cynical. Yes. Not the best trait she could have gotten. The siege, I think, is my biggest contributor to the war score. Hi. Meet the uh, the death stack here. Killing all your peoples. <laughs> My God, I I broke the. Oh wow, I don't even have, a, have anybody assigned to the lead in here. Actually, kind of crazy how effective this is. I mean, I, I, I didn't think it... I heard that uh, the infantry were broken, but um, this goes beyond broken. Let's come down here. Let's uh, kill some people. Oh, hi, boys. You're all dead now. He's not going to give up easily, because he knows uh, he he gives up. He's, he's going to die. I'm going to revoke his shit and then kill him. Also, we had a uh, peasant revolt. Apparently. Which is not cool. <laughs> Go ahead and follow them because you've got nothing better to do. You're not getting away. So the we killed him. And Somerset is now rebelling. Uh so what are we gonna do? Well, this one's actually really simple. What army levies? Oh hi there. Uh I have a oh <laughs> Oof. I have a trick. I'm gonna do the holy. I'm gonna take a holy war for your ass. And guess what? I win. Well, if you're gonna do that, then I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna kill these guys. And I'm gonna come over here and kill these guys. Uh, who are these guys fighting for? Wessex? Okay, they're fine doing that. They'll get taken into the Empire. <laughs> Hi, I caught you. You're dead now. Can I get better retomines yet? No, I'm going to have to do some more work on them. Ugh. Alright, righteous imprisonment. Um, apparently I can't righteously imprison him. Now, which is odd. How is the uh, independence faction looking? A fife. All right. I need to. Uh, as soon as my claim is finally freaking fabricated, uh, which will help when I since I have a an insanely awesome chancellor now. We're, we're gonna come down here. 
Santiago, yes. Uh, we are going to do that. Uh, I will create the Duchy of More. And it ended up being du jour sized. He likes me. So, uh, convert. You can force conversions if you have a good enough uh, relationship with somebody. So we fought off a civil war. That's uh, basically all we've done so far. Oh, you do not like me. That is okay, I do not care. You are Catholic now, so you like me even more because I am not an infidel. But uh, you don't like me because you have... Uh, I demand energy convert. But that's okay, because I'm going to make your day. You are now a duke, or a jarl. Uh, I can't... I'm actually unfortunately unable to make this so quite correct. Uh, and that too, so they're not going to be made right now. I made that rule and I'm going to try and stick to it. You're not dead yet. Why are you not dead yet? Can I request next communication? No, he is too friendly with the Pope. So I can't do that. If I saw somebody that had a heresy like this guy, uh, I actually can't see him see him, so I don't have Casa's belly. See, look, there's Somerset, part of my... So now it's just Cornwall. So I could... Uh, what all do you control? I might be able to do this. You own so little, so let's, yeah, let's do this. Let's declare war. Holy uh, du jour claim on Cornwall. Kill him. Hope this works. <laughs> uh, that's basically what's coming down to is it's a hope this works kind of deal. Lost one troop in dealing with this three. Shameful. I shouldn't have lost any. So we might actually uh, have really good progress this episode. But even better. Oh, I need to be in peace. Is, is this guy at peace? Is this guy at peace? He's at peace. I'm going to have to improve my relationship with him. Because I can offer him vassalization. And he just becomes part of my empire. Which is awesome. I, I love how it says I'm supposed to be able to do something with him. But I'm not sure what. I can't demand a religious conversion of you. Which is annoying. For 20 gold it improves my opinion, opinion of me. Hey look. You're Catholic now. Siege lengthens. Hopefully. Oh, it's looking like it'll work, right? It's going the way I want. Fate smiles upon me. Wife is pregnant. Uh, I need a new chancellor, because apparently chancellors down there suck. Chancellor. Improve diplomatic relations with that guy. And then one more set of sieges, and I should be able to just force him to give it up. Oh, I am so close. I think I've been taking more score, though. Oh, no, I can just enforce it. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, he's just going to give it to me. He surrenders.
Well, I, uh, I think it was a big day. A big episode. So I want to thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.